Yo, y'all want it like this? New chapter coming out. They implemented mad stuff. You could literally slide, bro. So if you guys want to be good at this game, editing is huge. Like, I'm talking like, if you can't edit fast, you're about to get bopped in the head. So make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy videos like this. I know it's been a while since I've made a video like this. Because the last one, as you could see, y'all loved it. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into this. Alright, so the first thing I could say is that if you guys want to edit fast, first of all, you got to know your edit binds, right? Edit binds are crucial. So if I were you guys, I'd put on edit and release. People know about this. It's nothing new. So once you do that, it's all timing based. Like basically, when you edit, it's not about how fast you click. I mean, obviously there's like speed to it, but like everything's timing. So you, you gotta time everything perfectly. I can edit like this and it's still fast, but it doesn't look that fast. So once you get your timing down, which is very crucial when it comes to editing, there's a lot of edits that you guys wanna learn. So basically say you're boxed up, right? There's always gonna be a dude that places a ramp here tries to break in your box like this. So one of the edits you're gonna have to have down are edits like this for placing a coin, or like this, or like that. A lot of people just like editing fast because it looks cool. The best thing you could do is edit fast, but edit consistently. So if you could edit this fast, or this fast, or this fast, and then you could reset fast after that, that's perfect. I know a lot of people don't really like, care about like walling anymore because you have mastered it. But what you want to do is you just want to go over these edits like multiple times. A lot of people are just like, yeah, Yo, you got to double edit fast. You got to be able to like, spam like this. But there's literally no point. What Are you going to go in a game and literally just go like this? Like, no. One thing I recommend is practicing these edits. You could start off slow. I know I talked about this in the last video, but make sure you're close to like the inside of the edit because it's faster. And then with confirm add and release, you could release right here and then the edit will go through. So you literally just flick it, right? Try to be as close as possible. So what I do for this is I edit it as fast as possible, right? It's okay if you're like not the best at it. You can start off slow, but make sure you press this cone after because this is crucial. Because you could always piece them like this and kill them. But that first shot, especially with all these sweats like attacking your box and stuff, that first shot is like the most crucial shot when it comes to fighting. Because usually when you do the first damage, it's there's it's more than likely that you're gonna win the fight. But make sure you get these down. Bones, piece box. Just make sure you get all this down because I know you guys want to get better. And last video I kind of focused on being flashy, so this video I'm gonna focus on like getting good at the actual game because nobody wants to be bad at this game. So another thing I do is I practice triple edits. So one thing I like to do is if they're attacking my box like this is I usually place a coin in my box when they can't piece me, right? What I do is I triple it up like this and then I'll either box them like this or I'll do like a Mario Classic thing. So say I'm in the box, they're pushing me. Boom, go up. Right, you could always place a stair up here if you don't want to do a quad edit. But yeah. That edit. This edit is so effective because people just don't expect it. So what I do to get better at this. Make sure you have your double edits down. If you don't have your double edits down. That's like the main thing you want to focus on. To edit this fast. One thing I practice with. Is literally get in a cone. And edit it twice. Just edit it twice like this. Don't just spam it like this. Once you get this double edit down, boom, like that, you wanna make sure your crosshair is on this third wall right here. So I know some people like going like this, it's all preference, but make sure it's either on here or here. So then once you're done editing, see how my crosshair is automatically on here when I'm done with these edits, just make sure you plan ahead. Uh, the way to edit fast is you're gonna have to plan ahead for the next edit, especially with triple, triple edits are just second nature. like. All these edits, all muscle memory. But I just want to take a moment to thank my sponsor, Rainmaker Games. They sponsor this video. You basically get access to hundreds of games, which obviously are play to earn. So you can make money off them. So you can earn money. You can obviously learn from them. You can connect with thousands of gamers. 
Some of the top games are Star Atlas, The Sandbox, Axie Infinity, and Decentraland. Definitely worth checking out. Link is gonna be in the description. This is literally crazy because like, it's literally the future. Like you could literally play games and make money off them. And literally the sign up is like free. So Rainmaker is actually about to launch their own token and they're gonna do a massive giveaway on their Twitter right now. So I'm gonna link that in the description too. I know you guys love giveaways. So yeah, check that out. Now let's get back into the video. Now that we're back, let's talk about sliding. Now Fortnite implemented this, not only cause it looks dope, not only cause it's in like cotton and stuff, but like, I'm telling you, this unlocks like a million different ideas when it comes to adding. So basically, obviously you're going faster, first of all. Second of all, you could get through stuff like, just like that, like you could literally slide through edits. If you could slide in triple edit, imagine how fast it would be if you were running into triple edit, right? So one thing I do is to practice triple edits is I slide into your triple edit. If you could do that, this becomes easier. This becomes easier. Everything. So you could pretty much do any move. What I'm going to say is that it doesn't matter if you edit with your map out. It does the same thing. So don't be forced to like look cool with a pickaxe or edit with your gun like this. It all does the same thing. I also recommend free building. I know some of you guys like to just like do retakes and all that. But when I free build, in order to get like warmed up before I play, I literally just edit like, cause it gets your crosshair placement. It warms up your crosshair placement. So basically you're not gonna miss shots. Pretty much warms up your thumbs. How I think of it is if you could do this and you master just like, say I did this slow. The next day, I know how to do this, so I could do it faster, and then I could do it faster, and then I could do it faster than that. So literally just build up, it's, don't rush anything. Get the basics down and then improve every single day. <clears throat> so now that we've gone through that, we're gonna go through some combos. I know you guys like looking at combos because obviously you guys wanna look dope in your building. So with this first combo, you wanna triple it into this, right? Place a stair right here. You wanna edit this. Right, place a wall here on the side. Make sure you're planning ahead when you edit because this whole, this move where I go to the side like this, it is so hard if you don't have good crosshair placement. Like make sure when you're done with these edits, you're right here. So then you can edit this. I like doing like a little 180, reverse 90 thing. Like that, or that's not 180, I don't know what that is. Like a reverse 90. And then I like triple editing out that. And then I like going to like move like that. It just looks dope. Turbo at it. Reverse 90. Boom, boom. Yeah. You got you got the gist of it. So I'm gonna do it slow one more time. Edit, edit, triple edit. Boom. Edit, edit. Make sure you're right here. Triangle. Go into this. And you're there. You could get consistent with it. It looks really dope. Because you just don't stop moving. And yeah. For the second combo, what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go down like this. Boom. Edit this. You brought it down like this. And then you wanna go into this little reverse 90 thing again. And boom, you're up. So I don't know, it just, like, honestly, it just looks cool. So it's gonna look like that. It looks pretty clean when you're going down. Obviously, it's like pointless, and it's obviously like something you do in creative, but it just looks dope. This this one's probably the hardest because it's all crosshair placement, but I do this in so many of my clips. So what I do is I triple edit it, boom, and then I go into this, this little tunnel thing. You could obviously just keep going. This one's kind of like the first one, but I don't know. I think it just looks clean because it's pretty long. So I go triple edit it, boom, boom. Boom, back into this, right? Like the first clip. If you had a clip like this, or like with any of these moves I showed you, make a tweet on Twitter and I'll retweet it. Just wanna see you guys. My Twitter is at fake guys, the link's in the description. But yeah, I just wanna see you guys like do these moves because they're low-key dope. Yeah, with that being said, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is how I edit fast. It may not work for you, but if it does, make sure to like and subscribe. And let me know if you guys want another of these, because he's bang. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Peace out.